Hey guys, Crypto Dad here again, and I've seen several complaints on Reddit about ledger boxes that the shipping seals are broken and they're concerned about tampering. Well, there are a number of reasons why this could occur. Uh, sometimes customs opens the box. Sometimes the glue doesn't hold on the shipping seals and other times the shipping seal might separate just because of wear and tear on the box. But what I really wanted to point out was this is not a concern uh, for the integrity of the wallet. Ledger wallets have what's called a genuine check when you connect the device to Ledger Live. This is a cryptographic handshake that verifies that the device is in fact genuine and has not been tampered with. It has to do with advanced cryptography. Advanced cryptography is what keeps blockchains secure, like Bitcoin and Ethereum. It is very advanced mathematics that can verify blocks and it can verify transactions. This same technology goes into crypto hardware wallets when they do their verification check. A cryptographic key is included on every device. And when you connect that device to Ledger Live, that key is paired with the corresponding key at Ledger, and then they do a cryptographic check. And so really all of this uh, concern and paranoia about that maybe your wallet was opened and tampered with is completely unfounded. So when you first set up your device, you're going to get an explicit genuine check, which tells you that the device is genuine. However, a lot of people don't realize that Ledger Live does a genuine check every time you connect your device and go into the My Ledger section down here. So you allow your secure connection on your device and then all you have to do is look up here at the top. You can see a picture of your device, the OS version, and right next to it you see this purple check mark that says genuine check. So you know that your device is genuine and has not been tampered with. As long as the device passes the cryptographic genuine check, you know it's fine, it's genuine, and it hasn't been tampered with, which means that I could go out behind the Walmart and find a discarded ledger device in a dumpster, take it home, and uh, do a factory reset and set it up with a brand new pin or restore it, right? I have no concerns about that because cryptography verifies the integrity of the device. I could buy one used. Uh, it doesn't matter. All you have to do is do a full reset by entering the pin incorrectly three times, and then it will start in factory condition, and I can set up a brand new pin and hit the ground running. So I know it's distressing if you see your shipping seal is broken, but that does not mean that the device is compromised. All you have to do is do the integrity check when you connect it to Ledger Live and you're good to go. Now, if you're, if you're super paranoid, you can uh, set up the device as new, run the integrity check, and then after it passes, you can do another reset and start from scratch if you don't want to connect the device uh, before you're sure it's genuine. You, it does have to be set up before you can do this check. So there are ways around this, but in the end, the integrity check is really the only thing that matters when it comes to the integrity of the device.